uh, hi in this video we will talk about how to capture a particular element screenshot in playwright okay so for this i created a class called capture element screenshot test and i created a test engine test called element screenshot so while you executing your framework your test cases using any framework so if you want to capture somewhere no any element screenshot if the particular test case is failed or if you want to verify that no that element is there means that uh, no particular element is there by taking screenshot you want to verify so whatever it is the requirement but i want to capture that element screenshot okay so for that how you can do that we will see in this video so let me create a playwright instance and then page instance headless holes new page now i want to navigate to so this url demo.automationtesting.in okay so once i go there let me wait for 2 seconds so after that i need to find the element this element right so alt equals to logo okay i'll take this to find that locator page dot locator what is that locator this is the locator and then dot you have screenshot method you see screenshot inside the screenshot okay in inside the screenshot method new you see that locator dot screenshot options locator dot screenshot options dot you need to set the path <laughs> means where you want to store this screenshot okay so i came to the next line to see the properly otherwise you can put here also right but it will go you know like it's very lengthy so it will not you know look into the visible area so i made it a second line to see the code properly set path inside the path you need to write paths path is coming from the java.neo.file dot file paths dot get you need to provide the location where you want and which name you want okay so screenshots slash element screenshot dot png any name you can give otherwise logo dot png okay so page dot locator which locator screenshot you want to take that selector you need to take dot screenshot inside the screenshot you need to mention new locator dot screenshot options dot set path paths dot get off where your location screenshots means i am creating a folder when you go here i do not have any folder with screenshots okay i do not have any folder with screenshots so if it is there it will use if it is not there it will create okay it will create this folder and inside the folder it will create a, this a screenshot with this name logo.png okay that's it that's it so thread dot sleep off we don't need actually but okay so i'm going to this website i'm finding that you know element which element i want to take the screenshot and i'm storing in the screenshot folder with name logo dot png okay just observe here also 
it will create the screenshots folder so in the project level let me execute this I'll drag a little bit. You observe the folder structure also. This is that created screenshots folder. And if you open logo.png, if you double click on this, you see that it has taken the screenshot of that particular image or locator, whatever you want, whatever you call. Okay. So the same way, I can do one more. Okay. okay, it is image, but I want to take some particular element. So this is a button, login button. So inspect this login button. So type equal to submit. Okay, type equals to submit. I'll take only one element. So I'll replace this locator with this. So I'll I'll rename login.png. Okay, login.png. So I'm capturing two element screenshots now. Okay, one is already there, so it will you know override, and another will create. Let me drag a little bit. It will create the login.png. You see that? It created login.png. You see that particular button screenshot it has taken here, that particular logos. So which element you want? You can capture that element and you can write this logic to capture the screenshot element. A particular element screenshot. Okay, page dot locator, that locator dot screenshot inside the screenshot method, new locator dot screenshot options dot set path, path dot get in which location you want and which name you want. Okay, so this is how you can capture a particular element screenshot in playlist. Okay, that's all in this video. Thank you for watching this video. Please like the video, share the video, and put your comment your thoughts in the comment section. And subscribe to the channel for interesting updates. Thank you.